Normal high temperature this time of year is 67. That's exactly where we were to finish last weekend, 67 on Sunday. And then we had the snow on Monday with a high of only 36. Tuesday, we made it to 59. Yesterday, the warming trend continued with 72. And today, the warming trend will um, peak at 77. Tomorrow, temperatures start to go back down again as a cold front moves in. Doppler 4000 showing no rain or snow anywhere in the state. And again, just a couple of clouds around. Later today, expect a high in the mid to upper 70s for most of us here in the Denver area. A little cooler in Boulder, 72. And then 70 in Fort Collins, 73 today in Greeley. Cheyenne, Wyoming, you'll top out at 69. In the mountains, uh, plan on 50s and 60s for the valleys. We'll see 70s on the western slope. And then mid to upper 80s down in southeast Colorado. So a wide variety of temperatures. But tomorrow, all of us along the front range and on the plains will cool off thanks to the front. 10 to 15 degrees cooler around here for tomorrow. There's the front right now. It's up near Yellowstone National Park. South of it, we have the southwesterly flow. That's what's going to warm us up. Front goes by tonight. Tomorrow, cooler, but staying dry. There's no moisture for that front to work with. And then the system back behind the front moves east into South Dakota. We've got one opportunity for seeing some precipitation over the next five days, and that's going to be Sunday evening. A small chance for some rain in Denver, perhaps a snow shower in the high country. You can see that chance right there late Sunday. And again, the temperature turn cooler as we head toward the weekend. 64 tomorrow, 60 on Saturday, and then to start the day on Sunday, we should have a freeze in the metro area, but not a hard one, right around 30. So cold at the start line for the Rock and Roll Half Marathon. Looks good for the Broncos game coming up Sunday evening. Looks good for next week as well.